Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is OG and today we are back with a part two. You guys really liked when we trolled on penalty kick for the first one, so I think I gotta do it one more time. We're gonna go Mr. P, Penny, Jesse. We might go with a bow, we talked about it a little bit, and see how that goes, just because of the mines. But um, now there are gadgets in the game. So Mali has a slow, I have an explosion, Tesla has an angry penguin. So it'll make it a little more fun, I think. Um, but we're just going to go into the games. If you guys saw the last video, you, you know what you're in for, pretty much. Um, so let's get into it. All right, guys, game number one. They're going to go double tank and Rico. So we can actually spawn trap that pretty hard. And I think it'll get to the point where we just get like so many supers that it's going to just like be overwhelming. Um, and we won't even be able to use them all because they're just going to feed us a lot. But they do have a lot of HP to deal with. So I think I'll just put up defensive. That way I can just start chaining like penny turrets. And um, you can see the Jesse and the Mr. P are both getting really good value. And we're not giving up too much value. I just got hit by the Frank like one time. But we're at the point where we can start moving the ball up. Bring it up, Melly. Wait. We can take out Frank first. And then, yeah. So I want to get my turrets... I'll do one more turret just for mid control so we can ensure a really good spawn trap. And the thing with my gadget, I don't want to break that side open because that def defeats like the whole point of the video. But we're going to get it and it'll be pretty good. I think, yeah. All right. <laughs> Super's down. Let's go. Tezel or Mally, you got to get yours. Oh, no. I think I'll put the ball like all the way in the back. Oh, Mally missed. Whatever. I, I guess that's fine. <laughs> they, they, they already know it's happening so it's just gonna like get to the point where they can't walk out of their spawn he oh he doesn't even have the shield there i'll know oh the frank the frank already knows what he's in for the rico's still going for it rico's not giving up mally has the healing one though so i'm gonna <laughs> oh, i feel so bad for this daryl he's still trying really hard but <laughs> there's not much you could do poor little guy Tesla's gonna take him out. I like. It's just gonna be like 50 seconds with this, guys. There's no way they can get out of this. There's no way. Maybe if they coordinate. I want to see if they're like they try doing anything, but they're just like running it down. If there was like KDA, like for just regular ladder, I think it would be insane here. So the penguins actually, it's doing a good job like tanking for Mally's turret when he can't shoot it to keep it healthy. But even if it does go down, like, we all have, like, our supers just ready to go. Um, the Daryl is actually going to switch up the sides. That, like, that worked decently. Oh, okay. Th so, they coordinated it a little better that time because I had to pinch over on the Daryl. Um, and Mally's turret is actually going to go down. So, they're making progress. They're getting ready for a big overtime push. And Mally's turret is going to go down. But he'll chain it right back. Um, and, yeah, we can troll them a little bit in overtime, too, I think. I feel... Like, the Daryl's given up at this point. No, he never... No, Snow never gives up. So I think we'll just, like, BM a little bit. <laughs> no, don't sue for me. No, 10% battery. Oh, no. Our turrets are all gone. No, Tesla's gonna score. Okay, so game number one. Um, I feel... I feel bad for them. <laughs> Alright guys, game number two. So these guys are pretty squishy. If we can get position on them, um, it should be okay. We just gotta watch out for the Colt to break walls um, and Crow if he has the gadget. Otherwise, not too, too much of a threat for us. Um, I don't want to feed any of them though. Oh, so I'm gonna rotate the ball. I'll go down actually. So good pinch from the BB there. And this comp, it's kind of like rough starting off a little bit, but when we get control, it's really, really good. So we're just gonna like look to do that again. Um, and we got the ball almost where we want it. So I think I'll, oh, are we just going for it right, right away? First supers of the game. BB, please. Let me hit you. BB. Okay. I'm just, the BB is like just doing that. So I'll just go over here and get my super. <laughs> I, I don't have time for that BB. I'm sorry. All right. There we go. We got our mortar out. Let's, uh, get her in there. And then the spawn trap begins. So the Colt can take out Mally's turret, so I guess that's why he like chose to put it over there. And they're trying to like pinch over. You can see my turret. The turret is just, or the mortar, it's just so good. Like, okay. It, the spawn trap should begin like for real now, because we're all like set up. Mally's turret, did Mally DC or something? I think he did. I can just coin them too. So he does have the crow gadget, but you can just see like how fast he got burst down from like the coins and everything. And 
I just want to wait for them to like kind of give up and like lose hope. <laughs> Mally's turret's not really doing anything. I think if I was him, I'd just like put it somewhere else that way. Cause he'll just chain it back. There we go. It actually got a tail. Um, and we just have to wait for 40 seconds and then we control them a little in overtime. But I don't know how I'd get out of this, to be honest, if I was on the other team. With their comp, I'd cult super like right there. But he really wants to kill Tezel, I guess. Um, but I would definitely cult super down there, just so... I wouldn't even focus on the ball. i just focus on killing us instead of the turrets, too. Because once you kill us, you can kill the turrets, right? We just, like, keep spamming them, pretty much. Penguin's actually going to, like, just track him down for me. And I think I... Oh, I'm going to go down here. No, I should have went down. If you followed up there, I would have went down. But we got to get ready for overtime. And the crow saved his gadget for overtime. That's actually pretty smart. Um... So our setup's kind of like ruined already and Mally's dead. So they actually have a fighting chance right now. Tezel's gonna take him out though and they should... All right, he's gonna take out my penny turret, but I got another one ready. I think, hmm, yeah. So I'll be forced to use my gadget there and it would have gotten taken out either way. That way at least I get some damage. And you know what, we'll just score, why not? All right, game number two, yeah, same thing. <laughs> All right, guys, game number three. So, oh, they have a tick. tick. They can actually like take our stuff out from in their base. So that'll be interesting to see. So Mally did opt for bow this game. Um, and that's probably better against the tick because it's one less thing that he can take it. Oh, okay. So maybe I'll just focus on someone else because tick is very toxic to lane against. They're going to take out Mally's... Uh, Turret pretty easily. The tick, tick actually like really counters this comp. Um, we can still do it, but we gotta be like a little more strategic with how we place, and we gotta like make sure like killing the takes a priority. So I think I'll just put my mortar back there and just focus on the tick. Yeah, I'm overextended. Melee shield me. Oh, close, close, close. The more walls they break in the mid, the easier it is for us to kill them. Because the walls, are like, they kind of, like, protect them a little bit. So we have to, like, pinch over to a side. But if it's wide open with our comp, we can just, like, spam them down. Okay, so you can see the tick's been doing work on my penny turret. So i got to, like, get another one ready. There we go. So he should be able to take it out here. And I wonder... Ooh, he'll take me out. I wanted... I was playing really aggro there so I could get my turret out right away. Um, But the tick damage did catch me out. So that's my bad. I think my teammates are doing a good job though like Tezel it's gonna take longer for him to kill the porter it's tankier and um maybe the penguins can even tank some of the shots up but they're getting their position back I just want to get my penny turned out there we go I wonder if it'll like take about I've seen it 1v1 people before oh no no it was close it was close if I was alive I could use like my super there but this game it's the tick the tick just like counters our comp counter comp sniped all right Maybe I'm just gonna go for the tick. You're ruining my video tick. Oh, he survived? How did he survive? Oh, I guess he has the regen star power on. They can score here. Girl's definitely close to rule. Oh, I tried interrupting it. I should have put it at the back. All right, that's, that's unfortunate. We almost like have to just run it down at this point. Not enough time to do anything. Oh, you can score that. Oh, no, it's on the line. <laughs> uh, that's okay. Like, it's not for pushing or anything. That's unlucky. All right, guys. So the bow didn't go as planned. Like, part of it was just due to the tick being there. Um, but the mines are less interactive than... The Jesse turret is so Melly went back to Jesse and that game that game was fun I don't care like that we lost or the spawn trap was suboptimal. We're gonna switch it up We're, We'll go on the left side of this game. I guess um, just gonna rotate over and you know, we can get into The pro gameplay imagine someone doing this in competitive it like high key this comps not too too bad You the only like bad part about this comp is Jesse and even then, like, when you get her turret out, it's, like, okay. But I feel like a competitive Barley would kind of destroy it. Maybe if they don't have a thrower, you could do it. <laughs> I don't know if, like, cornering it, like, this would be the strat for competitive. You might want to, like, actually score. But it's it's definitely good and entertaining. I'm sure the casters would have a fun time 
commentating on it. Um, the pyramid was pretty tanky though. He can like almost just like run straight at us. So we gotta be like careful. We gotta like cut it down a little bit. Um, Melee's turret's gonna go down. It's unfortunate, but oh, Primo can take that out too. He let Melee. No, he doesn't have another one ready. Oh, he got another one. <laughs> Jesse actually gets her turrets really fast. I didn't know the um it was that easy to get her super, but Primo. Oh, okay, no. He he's starting to give up a little bit. I saw a spin. I think he's just practicing his dodging. It's uh, not going very well for him, but. 55 seconds and then we can like troll them a little bit in overtime um but the, yeah the primo he's trying to give up hope this is this is the point of the video <laughs> when they just start giving up there's nothing you can do like honestly if he if you got super i'd just super down at like mali or me but even then like we could kill him i'd probably save it for overtime to be honest if like i actually wanted to win i think saving it for overtime would be the strap and then the bow and the Rico would have to take out the turrets. Um, but the the Rico, he kind of he figured out the strats not going up the side with all the turrets. Smart Rico. Primo, the Primo is still working on figuring that out. But Ezel is gonna take out the Rico, and I think the bow is picking up on it a little too. The Primo is just he's determined to get this left side good. Um, <laughs> overtime's coming up. Mally's gonna go for a trick shot, maybe. Primo can actually like he can almost run it through. Oh, that was close. It was just the time ran out a little bit. I would have Rico supered the left side there. All right, so we'll take out the Rico and Primo figured out that the right side's safer. So we don't want to score right away here. We'll just keep it in the corner. He's going to get bow mines. Not bad. My mortar's still alive though. Ball melee? Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where's Tesla at? I want I want Tesla to score. Here you go, Tesla. Let's see what you got, Tesla. Oh no. Very, very poor gadget use there. <laughs> okay, we can just score. There's like 10 seconds left. Alright, there we go. Game number four, we'll take the dub. Alright guys, this is going to be the last game of the video, so you know the drill, just get into the corner and then um, watch them struggle a little bit. So they have a Mort, Mort is going to be really bad into this comp, especially like the Jesse turret. The M's, they're all going to struggle once we get set up. I mean, the only brawler, like throwers can kind of contest it and then if they have like a penny or something like that, that could like work too. But once we get set up against this comp, they don't really have anything proper to take out the turrets with or anything and we're gonna get it like that simple so the m's could take out the jesse turret but i don't know we'll, we'll see how it goes i think we can just take her out though yeah so she does have hype i'm pretty sure hype works on turrets and stuff so maybe she could make something happen like that but the primo's sneaking up left side so maybe maybe they're learning they saw the last video and they realized that running it down like the side with all the turrets isn't the strat but we can just chain like really fast here and I'm gonna bait the Primo out a little bit. No, I got too close. I wanted to tease him. I gave him super, oh, uh, that's okay. It, it'll make it a little more interesting. Our turrets are still up, that's all that matters. I don't even like, I don't even do anything. Um, I think it's still good, yeah. They're picking up kills, so we're fine. Oh, me and Mally with the matching dark skins. It's cute. If only they had a Mr. P one. So yeah, they, they gave up at this point. They gave up, okay, this is the earliest give up, I think. Um, Even the more, he's not even attacking. They gave up at like a minute 10. The rest of them were like 55 seconds, something like that. Gabriel didn't give up. The Primos, the Primos are fighters. I've noticed that from this video. Um, But the Mortises, <laughs> they're already playing like Mortis and Bravo and they're probably not that good at it. So they're already like coming in with the mindset that they're gonna lose trophies. Okay, Primo is trying to see if he can punch through walls. I think he's determined. No, the more. Why me? Why me? All right, we'll take him out in 26 seconds. The penguin, penguin's just gonna 1v1 everyone. Like, I don't know why the more is being so aggressive. We can just all hang out. He really wants to kill me or Mally. Oh, they're going for it. They were playing. They, they were playing. Wow. 
They were baiting us in to spin with them and just let them out. That's smart. Okay. He had Primo or the fire one, so that's unfortunate. But they can they can win now. We don't have our setup. Mm, I don't know if they can win. But Mally's Jesse turret should be really good in overtime. I should have just thrown my turret out. I got so much value right there. I wonder I want to see the penguin kill him. Alright, how did they take out? I guess the M's took it out. We'll let Mally do a trick shot if he wants to. And then, oh, they gave us such good coin value. I got my super back already. <laughs> Alright, Tazzle. Pass it to me. And then, pass it to Mally. Bro. <laughs> I'll give it to Tezzle. Oh, no, I missed. Tezzle, shoot it. No, the board's going to save it. <laughs> That's okay. All right, guys, that is going to be for today's video. Just something fun. You guys liked it the last time, so I figured I'd do it one more time. Um, I'll definitely do it when Sprout's here, and then Mally had a cool idea. We could, like, trap someone in there and, like, primo throw them over. So we'll see if we could do that. That'd be funny. Um, but, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace.